Dr. Mandel with you. This video will keep nice and short and sweet. Why is it better to sleep in the dark? Now, the majority of my subscribers, as well as viewers on my channel, have pain. And I want to stress to everyone out there worldwide that one of the most important things to help pain, help repair the body, particularly uh, ligaments, muscles, discs, uh, injuries, is sleep. And if you're not getting the proper amount of sleep or the quality of sleep is going to inhibit the ability of that body or your body to repair and heal. This gentleman seems to be very comfortable. He's fallen asleep. But my best advice for all of us is that before you go to bed, half hour, an hour, try to keep the lights dimmer. Very important a hormone secreted from the brain, melatonin, that is what we need to sleep. This is what allows the circadian rhythm to work correctly. Now, even if your eyes are closed while light is on, it's still going to affect the, the production of melatonin. Now, me, if you look at me, this looks like me. I love darkness. I don't like it light at all. And uh, if we are looking for light, it's going to affect the quality of our sleep. So uh, just be aware that when you go to bed, and here is something I want to share with you. Let's go up here. Uh, texting on your iPhone. This is the worst habit that I do almost every night. But one bit of advice I can recommend is dim the phone. The less light that goes to the eye, the better and easier it's going to be to fall asleep. So uh, make sure you're dimming that light on that phone. It will make a huge difference. Now, if we look at the melatonin, just a brief uh, understanding about it. You can read this on your own, but basically this is uh, coming from the brain. This is part of our endocrine gland, and this syncs with the circadian rhythm. And its primary function is to regulate the sleep-wake cycle. Now realize that our body will be highest in melatonin at night and least during the day. Uh, in the morning particularly, and during the day it starts to rise again, preparing our body for a healthy sleep. Pertaining to sleep masks, I think they work great. I know uh, I have a lot of uh, emails regarding this, but I'll tell you that this will definitely help Increase production of melatonin, helping you sleep better. But you might also want to put some earplugs in there. That will actually increase the quality of sleep as well. Well, that's all this video is about, just giving you an insight. Because there are hundreds of thousands, even millions of people today who are suffering in chronic pain because the body cannot repair. Sleeping is so important. But it, again, making sure that you don't have a lot of light in your eyes, diminishing the light is the key before you go to bed and trying to keep that room as dark as possible. If you have clocks with the lights on them, turn them on an angle, uh, kind of work around the shades that light's not seeping in. You have to arrange it the best you can, but it will help the quality of sleep and it will help repair and healing in your body. I hope you uh, enjoyed this video. I, I liked it. It was simple, but it is the truth. Uh, share it on your social media. Uh, subscribe if you haven't. Check me out, motivational.com on Facebook. Leave your comments below. There's going to be plenty of people out there who's going to respond to this topic because everyone sleeps. Make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.